first phone call we got was the train hit the truck. 30 minutes later, it was truck hit the train. You're kind of numb, it's a little bit of shock, trying to get everything wrapped around in your own head on what the hell just happened. I wish I would have engaged the insurance company better. I wish we would have had better guidance to help our witnesses. Me being one of them, I got grilled several times in depositions and I could have been probably prepared better. I've seen several witnesses tell the truth and the jury did not believe a word. When something bad happens in a trucking accident, that's all over the news and you can see it. Why? The video cameras are there. We grew up believing in the American justice system, that if we tell the truth, justice will prevail. Over the last decade, there was a 967% increase in the verdict size against trucking companies. There's actually an academy of truck accident attorneys, which certifies both attorneys and paralegals on how to sue trucking companies. They're trying to accuse people who have been involved in accidents of being unsafe because that gins up the award. Well, what do you mean? You don't really, you don't believe in safety? Well, yeah, I do, but okay, well, couldn't you have done enough? Well, then you start thinking, well, okay, yeah, I guess I could have done that if I'd have thought of it. It's like, okay, that's ridiculous. Now you're opening yourself up and you're creating a straw man argument. The reptile theory is something that was created by a couple of trial lawyers about a dozen years ago. It's really about getting to the reptile brain in the juror. They're telling the jury that by awarding these huge damages, that they are gonna send a message to the industry to be safer. The mongoose is agile. It's not afraid to attack. It ducks, it darts, and when it does get hit by a cobra, it has a natural immunity to snake them. We wanna use the mongoose method as that balance against the reptile theory so we can rebalance the scales of justice. And how do we defeat the reptile? Bring in the mongoose. Dr. Kanaski is a neurocognitive behavioral scientist. He will provide coaching in how to combat the tools that the trial attorneys have been using against us. And that's really what, what mongoose uh, gives you. They sell science, they don't practice science. We're gonna sell science and actually practice science, which is gonna lead to great outcomes. Yeah.